Hi, my name is Boris and we will talk about problem C. So in this problem you are given an N which is equal to 100 points on the uh, plane and those points are all lie inside one rectangle. Uh, let's enumerate those points from 1 to N and you also want to find like another point such that if you see, uh, if you look at all the N points on the plane, they are all sorted according to some permutation. Let's for simplicity say that we want permutation 1, 2, 3, n. So for example, we have like three points, 1, 2, 3, and we want to find another point such that the first point is to the left, second point has like clockwise order, uh, and the third one also. So basically you want to find the area of such possible positions x such that those n points are ordered in this order. So what you need to do here, basically, uh, each of the pair of existing points, for example, first and second, generates like a set of possible positions where our x could be. Basically, if you just uh, create a line between one and two, and then you can say that uh, all positions which are to the right of this line uh, are good for us. So basically what we need to do, we generate those half planes for each of consecutive points so we will generate like n minus one half plane and then we need to intersect those half planes. Uh, because n is very small, it's just 100, basically you can use uh, like any possible algorithm like n, n squared or n to the power of three, uh, which works to generate the intersection of half planes. And when we generate all of them, we can just need to uh, count the, like the square of all of this, the area of this. And to do this, we just like iterate over all possible triangles inside this area and just sum this up. And that's all.